Yeah, yesterday's airstrike, something on the minds of so many tonight. As intelligence officials work to determine how Iran could or will strike back. Tonight, Bradley Burns saying, quote, we all need to be on our toes. With tensions high in the Middle East after a targeted U.S. airstrike killed Iran's top security and intelligence commander, tonight, Iran vowing revenge. We know that they're going to do something, but they're not in a position to attack us in a conventional sense. They know that we can overwhelm them. Congressman Bradley Byrne weighing in, expressing his support of President Trump's decision to kill Qasem Soleimani and an Iraqi leader. The president made the right decision. This man, Soleimani, has killed several hundred American servicemen and women, and he presently or was threatening many more. And so the president was protecting American lives. That's his job. The U.S. today sending 3,000 more troops to the Middle East. Local Navy veteran John Coleman with this message for them. God bless you, my brothers and sisters in arms. You, you make a difference over there and come home safe. As the world waits for what happens next. So they're going to do something that we can't really predict right now. Maybe cyber warfare, they may go after one of our allies, they may attack some American business over there. We all need to be on our toes. Uh, I know there's a lot of men and women who are going over into harm's way but I think it's necessary. I don't want to see us get into a protracted war. Uh, if, if a response is needed, it needs to be swift. Well, the move of sending those 3,000 troops add to what the Pentagon says is 60,000 already in that region. Live in Baldwin County, Michael Warwick, Fox 10 News.